Hey, what's up? Jigzer here. Looking for a way to relive your favorite memories or showcase a special event? Well, iPhone has a built-in feature you can use. In this video, I will walk you through the steps of creating a slideshow video with music, transitions, and more, all right on your iPhone. Let's go. iPhone Photos has a built-in slideshow feature. This is a quick and easy way to create a basic slideshow with music and transitions. To create one from photos on your iPhone, here's how to do it. Open the Photos app on your iPhone. Select the photos you want to include in your slideshow. You can do this by tapping on the Library tab and then choosing All Photos or Days to view your photos. Then click Select in the top right corner and choose the desired photos. Tap the Menu button and select Slideshow from the list of options. Your slideshow will automatically play with a default theme and music. While the slideshow plays, you can tap the screen to bring up the options menu and do some edits. There are different themes available that change the transitions and overall style of the slideshow. You can also edit the music. Choose from Apple's built-in music options or select a song from your own library. The playback speed can also be adjusted by making the slideshow play faster or slower. Once you're happy with your creation, tap Done in the top left corner. The slideshow won't be saved as a separate video by default, but you can achieve this in two ways. The first method is screen recording. Open the control center and tap the screen recording button. Start the recording, then play your slideshow. Once finished, stop the recording. This will capture the slideshow along with any control center interactions on your screen. You can then trim the video to remove unwanted parts. Next is the Play Memory Video option for iOS 16 and later. Open the album containing your selected photos. Tap the three dots menu and choose Play Memory Video. This will automatically create a video slideshow with music and some basic editing options. Tap the Share button and then Save Video. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.